What emotion do you feel when you see an image of a shark? Anger, shock, terror, hostility? If you answered yes to any of these, you're not alone. Studies recently found that when a large group of people were asked if they were afraid of sharks, some 98% of the people instantly answered yes. But of the people that said that they were afraid, not a single one of them had ever seen a shark in the wild. It's because of this mindset that more than a third of the entire world shark population has been completely decimated. And history has clearly shown, no one seems to care. In fact, when most people hear about the mass slaughter of sharks around the globe, they think it's a great start and can't wait for the rest of them to be gone. Even though more people die every year from auto accidents, bee stings, lightning strikes, and yes, even coconuts. Sharks year in and year out rank number one of what people are singly most afraid of. Not because of facts or experience, but because of a simple four letter word, the worst of all the four letter words, fear. So as you will soon come to understand, as did the 32nd president of the United States, Franklin Delano Roosevelt, who so eloquently told the world. Let me assert my firm belief that the only thing we have to fear is fear itself. For me, life is like a book full of chapters, and everyone's chapters are different. But I believe it's important to continue writing as many chapters as you can before your book comes to an end. Now, if you would have told me that one of my chapters would include me one day swimming in the middle of the Pacific Ocean searching for tiger sharks, I would have laughed at the likelihood of that ever happening. And if you would have told me that one day I would be face to face with a 15-foot tiger shark, I probably would have told you that you were completely crazy. But in order to tell you how I got here, or how this was even possible, I must first start from the beginning.